This is the third pill of the basic module of the O11 Advanced Broadband Technologies. This pill is devoted to the access networks and in particular, the third one, we focus on wireless access uh, networks. Uh, in this case, uh, we have uh, gathered uh, videos from YouTube and selected three of them that we consider that can illustrate the concepts we want to uh, include in this um, basic model. In particular, we have uh, divided this section in two um, parts. One is uh, devoted to cell phone and WiMAX technologies and the other devoted to Wi-Fi. The first one includes one video and the second one includes two videos. For the one devoted to cell phone and WiMAX, the title we have uh, in considered appropriate for this uh, video is from GSM to WiMAX through UMTS. GSM uh, stands for Global System for Mobile Communication. It's the first generation of mobile cell phones. Uh, uh, WiMAX is an extension of Wi-Fi to, to be used in local and wire, uh, local metropolitan and wide area networks. And uh, UMTS is the third generation of uh, uh, mobile cell phones and it stands for Universal Mobile Transmission Systems. So in this video, the, 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 the speaker does a review from the first generation uh, of uh, cell phone networks to the third generation. So we are not, uh, uh, or they are not discussing about long-term evolution, evolution, which is the fourth and fifth generation of mobile systems for telephony. This is uh, going to be considered in the advanced uh, model. Uh, besides of that, uh, there is also uh, worth to mention that uh, in the video um, it is considered also the WiMAX technology. This uh, WiMAX or WiMAX, whenever you want to, WiMAX, uh, it's I think the best way to pronounce in English, is uh, technology derived, as I said, from Wi-Fi that can be applied uh, in local area networks, uh, also in metropolitan area like Wi-Fi, also in metropolitan area networks. The um, standard is IEEE 802.0. Uh, 16 and there is an extension of this a triple uh, 802.16 extension e that uh, works for wide area networks so uh, i encourage you to to watch this video and then this uh, video can be concatenated with other videos that can complement the uh, information and the knowledge on this topic For what regards to Wi-Fi, we have selected two videos. One is uh, presented by and, and Andy T. Sharma. It's a, it's a very cute and fun video, but it's uh, more informative than technical. But I think we kindly recommend you to watch it because it illustrates uh, what is uh, Wi-Fi, very simply, what is Wi-Fi, which are the, their main characteristics, very simply too, and how can be used, uh, especially uh, as a, at, at your home. The second one is a video uh, presented by David Gold. It's a really more technical video, and it's uh, 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 discussing all the elements of Wi-Fi and what uh, uh, characteristics, uh, technical characteristics, in more in detail than the previous one. Uh, also, these two videos are concatenated. So, as you know, in YouTube, when you finish with one video, another one comes. So, in order and concerning the same topic. So, we kindly recommend you to continue the um, video of David Gold because after this one, they should appear uh, three videos from Rag Jain. 
professor from Washington, Washington, a very prestigious professor from Washington University that also describes more and more in detail the technical aspects of uh, the Wi-Fi technology. So by the way, Wi-Fi comes from uh, wireless fidelity and it's an acronym that wants to uh, s be similar to uh, was in the past uh, high fidelity so for uh, for when you want to reproduce sound with a very high fidelity so we really recommend you to continue so uh, with uh, after the these videos with those uh, that are following and of course you can reach uh, uh, the uh, you can go whenever you want one after the other so this uh, videos have been selected by Sepp Soler Pareta from Telecom Barcelona at UPC, who is also the narrator of this film.